Hello everyone and welcome to another brand new Big C TV taste test. My name is Chris aka Big C. So of course, as I'm sure a lot of you know, I like to try out all different kinds of interesting sodas. I'm especially a connoisseur of Mountain Dew flavors. Um, and today I came across a brand new variety of flavor uh, from a company that doesn't normally make soda, which is interesting. Um, best part about this is right now if you have the 7-Eleven app you can actually get one of these for free and try it yourself that's what I did so I am going to try Mutant a brand new soda from Monster of course Monster are the guys who make the energy drinks so the description about this soda there's nothing soft about this drink Mutant is a defiant new breed with its an attitude all its own, it's an evolution of sparkling refreshment. The perfect balance of drinkability and energizing flavor. Refreshment energized. This is the Red Dawn flavor. So I'm assuming this is basically the counterpart to like Code Red. They also have a regular flavor that I'm assuming is kind of like the regular Mountain Dew. So I'm gonna give this a swig and see how it is. So let's see how Mutant Super Soda by Monster is. Smells very potent. Let's let's give this a shot. Bottoms up. Not really sure what to make of it. Um, let me give it another swig. It doesn't taste like Mountain Dew at all, which I think is interesting. It kind of have has like a passion fruit flavor, which is not at all what I expected out of this. Like it actually closest um, closest comparison is to the uh, the mango Mountain Dew that just came out, which I find weird. Not <laughs> not what I expected. Um, it's not bad. Um, I wouldn't say it's anything groundbreaking or anything you just have to go out of your way to pick up. It's not bad, though. Um, definitely worth a shot. Um, I definitely think it tastes better than Monster. I'm not a big Monster fan. Um, most energy drinks are just not that great in terms of flavor. Um, this isn't bad, so... If, if regular Monster tasted like that, I would probably buy Monster way more often. This as opposed to it, um, it's, it's a decent attempt at a soda, so I give them credit for that. I don't think it's anything amazing. It's not going to convince you, oh, I want to get a, a Mutant out instead of a Mountain Dew, but uh, it's not bad. Let me give it one more swig. It tastes a little more cherry in there that time. Um, so yeah, there you go. That is my first impression of Mutant, the super soda from Monster, um, which you can go out and get for free if you have the 7-Eleven app. Download it, uh, head to your lo local 7-Eleven, and you can pick one of those up for free and taste it yourself. So pretty cool tip. Anyway, that is going to do it for this episode of Big C TV Taste Test. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to hit that subscribe button on YouTube. Be sure to follow us on Twitch, where I'll be streaming lots of video games, including Gears of War 4, Titanfall 2, Call of Duty Infinite Warfare, Destiny, and much more. Um, if you want to follow me on social networks, you can follow me at Big C TV Show on both Twitter and Facebook. And this is the first time I'm able to announce this on a video. The Big C TV Patreon is officially live. That's right. If you want to help shape the future of Big C TV, now is your opportunity. Uh, just go onto patreon.com and look up Big C TV. Um, and you can decide to become a patron and basically subscribe to Big C TV um, for varying dollar amounts. It depends on what you are wanting to pay 
Um, it ranges anywhere from a dollar all the way up to 80 bucks. And each tier gives you additional rewards. So if you order a mid-tier um, option, you get all the previous rewards plus that specific one. So it keeps building up, which is kind of cool. So the more cool stuff you want, you'll get it if you pay a little bit more. Um, and the biggest thing is this is not here just to give me money just because. This is actually here to help me improve the quality and to do more videos for Big C TV. Um, in case you didn't know, Big C TV, of course, is entirely self-funded right now. I pay for everything. All the stuff I try on taste tests, all the games, all of it I do myself. And I have a full-time job, so I don't have a whole lot of time to devote to it, which is why videos are kind of sporadic. Um, my setup also isn't the most top tier, but it works. Um, so the goal behind this is to help shape the future of Big C TV by allowing me to maybe take some time off of work to do videos. Um, maybe pay for stuff I wouldn't normally try, um, just to try it and give you more content options. Um, to improve my equipment setup so I can make better, more high quality videos. Um, so all of this will be accomplished through Patreon. Um, so if you want to help shape the future of Big C TV and become a patron on Patreon, I thank you. Um, I'm working on doing some other exclusive stuff for Patreon, including coming soon there will be an exclusive video series that is only for Patreon subscribers. Um, so if you want to be a part of that, you will need to be a Patreon subscriber. But... Otherwise, it's going to be business as normal. I'm not really going to be doing a whole lot of different things until the, I actually can get some Patreon funds going. Um, but for the most part, if you don't want to pay any money, that's completely fine. You'll still be able to enjoy everything that I do now. Um, and if you can, awesome. I greatly appreciate the support. And it will help, to, help me to create better quality, more frequent content for you to enjoy on Big C TV. So, patreon.com, look up Big C TV if you want to become a patron uh, today. And that's going to do it for this taste test. My name is Chris, and I will see you next time. Peace! Set your breath.